a great magician. Your clothes are red! What's up you guys, Jerk120 here with Kalen Morelli and Chase Duncan and we're going to give you a little tips and tricks of how to approach complete strangers and just go right into performing magic for them. What's up everyone, I'm Kalen and so a lot of things to do with magic to walk up to like girls or whoever, right? The thing that's hard is like for instance like these two girls on the bench, like right now if you hesitate you can't. I swear he like Magic trick? Of course. Sure. Have you guys seen a magic trick yet today? You guys got your magic Yeah, today. Oh my god. That's right here. Alright. Show you guys something with the ring, okay? Okay. Watch my finger. Oh. You see that? Yeah. I can actually do it again, look. Okay. Take it right here. Okay. And throw it back on. Put your fingers like this, okay? Like this? Without look or without touching that straw, is there any way I can move it? No. No? Well, I feel like maybe blowing, right? Yeah. Like, like, like blowing might work? Yeah. Oh, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Here's another good day. You do. So? So. Right going into it, so the problem with that was like the confidence like went down like right yes, like it's one trick in there because like walking up I was like I felt confident like I felt like I was into it but then like one trick in like I hesitated on saying something and then I just didn't own it so you have to like you have to just keep on going and your confidence has to stay at the point so so yeah what happens in, in situations like that where uh, if if something goes wrong so if something goes wrong, well, first of all, if a trick goes wrong, it never goes wrong because it's magic and the majority of people have never seen magic. So it's pretty much exactly how it's supposed to go, whatever happens. And that's the way you should always rock it. So if you mess up, then it was meant to be. So it's like nothing ever goes wrong with magic. That's how you handle stuff. That makes sense? All right, so you've seen Jarek perform and you've seen Kalen perform and now you're watching me, which should tell you like if they can do it. Like that's one thing because they're real look good looking guys, but I'm on the lower end of that. So if I can do this, you can do it. It's gonna be a card trick. And no one really likes card tricks. So let's go for. Let's go for these guys. Probably like card tricks. Uh, you do you like card tricks? No. No, but no. Do you guys hard. like card tricks? Sure. Yeah. Uh, I'll grab one. Yeah, no. Yeah. Really nervous. Do I show you or me? You. Yeah, I don't want to look at. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you to sign it. Okay. Right on. Do you guys have? I got. I got one. Or is, no, it's fine. Right don't even hear. Actually, instead. Instead, just take it and just. Yeah, yeah. Just, just kiss it instead. Yeah, no one. You got it. And then throw it back in the air. All right. So now your card is different from all the other cards, right? Your, uh, the other cards are a little bit jealous of your card. So now all I have to do is go through and look for your kiss. All right. I just got to go for it. This is. There it is. Seven. No? Here, you take that one. See, actually, here. Um. Oh, you know what happened? I don't know what your kiss feels like. It's a magic trick. You're gonna ruin it. There's. Do you know how many people are watching? There it is. Oh, okay. It was a little sweeter than I thought it was gonna be. Here, all I have to do. Look. What's that? Yeah, see? Okay. The magic's in there. Okay. Is that it? Yeah. That was your turn? Yeah. What do you want? That's pretty, okay. Good job. How awkward was that? A little bit. A, a little, little bit awkward. awkward. Did it feel weird when you were walking up? Not really. What made it okay? Okay? Yeah. Or it awkward? Or awkward. Or both. What made it? Okay. I guess the dog. Awkward. Like the kids. No, for me, to, yeah, the kids a little bit weird. <laughs> up until that point, though. Yeah. Did it feel weird? You were in, like, you. Okay. Everybody likes that. Thanks, you guys.
Same. Last words or closing thoughts? Everybody likes magic, and I'm never gonna see him again, which makes that a lot easier. <laughs> Chose the dog? Yeah, so that kind of thing is probably, I mean, after doing it for a while, you kind of just get a feel for it. You can see like the easiest way in to your situation. Um, with them, they had a dog, so just show the dog card trick. That's funny, I guess. I don't know. I didn't know if it was going to be funny, but they seemed to enjoy it just fine. So. so when I went up to those girls, the first thing that they said was, you're shaking. I was like, right, that's because I'm supposed to. Like, that's how, that's, that's how it works. I'm supposed to shake, you know. So I've been doing magic for a while. Like, I, what if I purposely mess up a trick? I'm gonna like purposely just not get it right, and then I'm gonna just see what happens. Okay? Oh, okay, okay. So I'm not even gonna like. I won't even do like a crazy trick, but let's just do this. Like, I'm gonna set up something for like two minutes, and it's gonna be this crazy trick, and then it's not gonna work. And then I'm gonna try and redeem myself and see what happens. Okay? So. Much. We don't have any passes. So you, you guys can't get in? Yeah, I don't pass either, so okay. we're just filming out here. Okay. So have you guys seen, wait, have you guys seen a magic trick yet today? No. Wait, you guys haven't? No. Seriously? No. Well, you guys should probably see it, right? yeah? I guess so. Oh, you guys like magic? Sure. What's your name? Kayla. Kayla? I want you to take the cards. Okay. Just take them all and mix them up, okay? Oh, okay. I can't. There, I'll look at you. Um, this is the best one in the next. Uh, watch this. So, what, what we're going to do first is I'm going to take the phone and just kind of squeeze it. Okay. So, we're going to get back to that in a second, okay? But I want you to think of a card, right? So, you think of a card and I want you to just name it out loud. King of Hearts? King of Hearts, cool. And I want you to just cut the deck in half and that's going to be the King of Hearts. Not right there, but right here. The King of Hearts. So. Where's the King of Hearts? I mean, oh, was, you're close, right? You, you missed about like five cards. It was close, right? So, like, can I try to try and do myself? Like, Do you want to pick the King of Hearts or pick a different card? Because it can be totally any card. Any, I guess, any card? Any card? No. Alright, well, here, do this. Just, uh, just touch the back of one yeah, card. Yeah, normally it drops and it doesn't right. Remember, actually, you take it out, show it to the camera. Okay. Watch this, I'm going to do this really slowly, okay? Put the card. <laughs> and the whole time he's sitting there like, I have a pen. I'm going to try and make it jump to the top, okay? Watch this. So you jump to the top? No? It happened really, really fast, but your car jumped to the top just like that. Is that it? No. <laughs> this is two times in a row. Okay, so I said I'm going to try and redeem myself. So what was your card? Just name it out loud. Uh, six diamonds. Black. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. That's it. That's it? Did he redeem himself? Like, did it work? Even yeah. though I messed it up, you guys yeah. kind of forgot about it? Yeah. yeah. Alright. Cool. Alright, <laughs> see you guys. Have a good one. So, I think the, the lesson on this is, so even if you mess something up, I think, same thing like I was saying before, the goal is just to like, just flow with it and not show them that you're like, that you're like flustered or anything like that. Because it, like the thing is, is they like, they don't know that like the first trick wasn't supposed to mess up, right? So whatever happens with magic is supposed to happen. That's, that's the main thing. You just jazz with it and you just roll with it. With whatever happens, you just rock it. So I think that's the main thing. It just takes practice, just like kind of going out and just doing stuff and just kind of thinking on your feet, see what happens. One of the biggest lessons I learned from Blaine was the fact that you just roll with exactly everything, right? So. 
explain if someone calls him out or something, he's just like, yeah, 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 but watch this. And he just moves on. Like, you just agree and move on with people. Because, like, that diffuses, like, all the situations. Like, if someone's being a dick and they're saying something, you're just like, yeah, yeah, but watch. And you just, like, just move on, and it works. It just kind of, like, diffuses the situation. That's, like, the best way to just get through super awkward people just trying to be dicks. With with that being said, this is like one of the lessons that I learned that's along the same way. This works with magic, but also works with just like life in general. If someone's like bullying you or name calling or picking on you or saying anything, is just like agree with them and take it as a compliment. So if someone's just like, it's so, so it's just, just make like, it real awkward. Just like, dude, you're so gay. It's just like, hey, yeah, man, thanks. I'm glad you're enjoying it. And then just walk away. Just like agree with it. Like, uh, like if you agree with it, then they're just like, okay, I guess I don't have anything left yeah. to say now. <laughs> but as soon as they see that, like it triggers you, then they're gonna keep agitating you. But if you agree with it and then mistake it for a compliment, when life, <laughs> then it, uh, you'll be surprised. Diffuses a lot. Oh yeah, disarms everyone. All right, you guys. So that was just a few tips. If you want Kalen and Chase to come back for more videos, please leave comments in the description for questions that you want answered, so we can take it to the streets and perform it for real life. And check out Kalen's channel, YouTube.com/slash Kalen Morelli. My man Chase over here doesn't really. Have, he's he's just along for the ride. He's under the through, radar. Under the radar. But these two work together. Travel from Florida. Las Vegas, now here in California. So please let us know, follow them on Twitter, follow all the stuff they do. Talented, talented professional right here. So uh, leave us comments, let us know, hopefully we can get these guys back and do some more performing stuff. We'll do it in slow motion, okay? Yeah. Ow! All right, ready? Watch this. Did you feel it? We'll do it again, we'll do it again. <laughs> And you say, I'm going to make your card jump to the top. That's step one. But you have a double lift here. You took two cards as one. 